welcome back to my channel you guys in today's video we're gonna be trying out nyx it's called a shine loud pro pigment lip shines it came with 24 different shades they run for 11 dollars and 50 cents and girl it's supposed to be one of the first ultra high pigmented lip glosses with a really high shine it's supposed to give us you know a two-step process here it's supposed to have a 16 hour wear feather proof transfer proof smudge proof we're supposed to be able to drink eat and still look cute all at the same time so it's supposed to be non-sticky and ultra glossy lip color so today we're going to be trying them out we're going to be swatching them on and just see you know how do they look on how do they feel on is it actually worth it is it smudge proof transfer proof we're going to be testing it out and i hope you guys enjoyed today's video please don't forget to like share and subscribe for more videos just like this one i do post videos weekly and as always let's jump on in and try these out before we swatch the first lip shade that I have here. I do want to read off of their website what it says. Obviously, if you guys didn't know, this is vegan, cruelty-free, and it says here also that it's infused with rich, loving oils, including macadamia seed oil, corundiner, I think that's how you pronounce it, fruit oil, jojoba seed oil, apricot kernel oil, and a passion fruit seed oil. So it seems like it's supposed to be really nourishing on our lips as well. So I'm really excited to try this one out. The first shade that I have here, it is Magic Maker, which I really love this shade. And it is a dusty, nude, mauve lip shade, which, you know, I really love very, you know, everyday type of lip colors, even though today girl we're bold <laughs> but let me show you the swatch I've already swatched it on the back of my hand for you guys literally you guys with one swatch of the applicator it is a very very ultra high pigmented exactly what they're describing so far on their website we'll see you know once we apply it on our lips but so far I'm really impressed and I really love the dope applicator it has a fine point to it I feel like you're able to line your lips you don't really need a lip liner if you don't want to use one and I really like that it has also a soft dope applicator which I feel like you're always able to apply an even amount on your lips you guys know I really love a dofa applicator so you guys let's go ahead and try on magic maker Now for life goals, you guys, this one is a peach nude. And to be honest, I was expecting it to be a lot lighter than the shade it's currently looking. So I've already done a swatch in the back of my hand. I'm gonna go and show it to you guys really quickly and this is basically it it's a really pretty shade to be honest i find as i find it pretty pigmented it's probably not a lip shade that i would naturally gravitate towards but keep in mind guys i purchased all of these lip shades online and actually am missing it too with christmas and everything this month you know and covid a lot of my shipments haven't been coming in they've been coming in wrong and so let's just say <laughs> I did my best in purchasing, seeing, you know, these products and lip shades the best I could online. But you guys, I will say that there is no scent to these so far. So I'm really pleasantly surprised. And they're really pigmented and really hard to remove the swatches from the back of my hand. So they are very, 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 they will hold the test of time, let me tell you. So you guys, let's go and try on Life Gold. Global Citizen, you guys, this one is a medium neutral nude lip shade, and I've already swatched it on the back of my hand, so let me show you how it looks. And I, and I honestly really love this lip shade. I feel like it is such a pretty nude lip color, and you guys know me. I love a neutral toned, you know, foundation, concealer, lip color. I just feel like they complement my skin complexion really, really well, and I really love this shade. So let's go ahead and try on Global Citizen. lip 
shade, you guys. This one is called Ambition Statement, and this is a warm peach brown lip shade. Let me show you how this one looks. To be honest, I really love this lip shade. I feel like this is such a beautiful, wearable fall lip color, but I can see myself actually wearing this not only for the fall season, but throughout the year, just because it's not too orangey, but it's not too red, and it's just enough pigmented enough that you get a little bit of color, but it's still like a really nude type of lip color that you can, you know, wear, but we'll see, you know, obviously once we try it on. So you guys, let's go ahead and try on Ambition Statement. all four lip shades you guys now let's go ahead and talk about them so to be really honest I'm gonna say that I'm gonna start off with the packaging I do like the packaging of this I feel like it's a nice little duo. You get a nice gloss and you get a really ultra pigmented lip color. It has a nice Adofa applicator. I honestly thought that I wasn't going to be a big fan of the brush applicator that the lip gloss or lip oil has. And to be honest, I didn't mind it at all. I feel like I was able to apply an even amount on my lips. This lip oil definitely feels really moisturizing. I feel like I have a high shine as well. So it's definitely giving us that glossy effect that I'm looking for. And I really like it, you guys. It definitely doesn't feel sticky on the lips, which is a big plus. I'm not a big fan when lip products feel heavy and sticky and gunky. And this does not feel like that at all, which I'm really surprised. I honestly thought it was gonna be like gooping from the sides of my lips, but it wasn't. And as of for the liquid lipstick, to be really honest, lip color, I actually really like it. The applicator picks up enough a lip product uh, to apply on your lips. I was able to apply an even amount, no no patchiness, no streakiness at all. And it was, the applicator picked up more than enough a lip color to apply on your lips, which I really, really like. So I feel like even though you're not getting a lot, it's not like a full size lip color, but you know, this is gonna last you a really long time because a little bit of color will go a long way when applying this on. And to be honest, there is no scented lip oil or the lip color as well, which I really, really like. And I really like it because you don't really need to wear them both. You can wear one. And if you want to have a gloss over it, you can, and just to, you know, amplify the effect and give it a little bit more of a mood. But I really, really like this. It makes it really, really different than anything that I've recently come across and have reviewed. To be really honest, you guys, I'm not even going to lie. This reminds me of the Maybelline Super State 24-Hour Lip Colors, just because, you know, it has a dual end. It has a kind of like a one, two-step kind of thing. And the lip color of this, you know, has a different applicator as well in the Maybelline. And the longevity of this lip color is long wearing. I mean, it's same thing. It's supposed to be feather proof, transfer proof, all of that. And to be really honest, you guys, this one from NYX was so much harder <laughs> to remove from my lips. Even in the swatch in the back of my hand, you have to move really, really quickly if you decide, you know what, I don't like this look, I want to change it just because it was so hard to remove it from the back of my hand and on my lips. I went in with the Garnier Mercier Cleansing Water. That was really hard. It didn't budge the lip product. And then I had to go in, <laughs> you guys, I'm kind of embarrassed to share this with you, but I went in with the Pond's Cold Cream. Girl, I let it sit on my lips and it removed the lip product and that was a whole process and I was blown away. So this is definitely transfer proof, smudge proof. I'm even gonna kiss the back of my hand to show you guys really quickly. I feel like the lip oil is definitely gonna transfer, but as for, you know, maybe the lip color itself, I feel like it's not. So let me go ahead and kiss the back of my hand really quickly. And now this is basically, you guys, so it does not transfer whatsoever, and I really like that. So this is perfect if you're going to have a long day at work, or if you're going to be traveling, or an event, or anything like that. You know, you want to avoid, you know, having to reapply your lipstick and always look ready. So I really, really love it, you guys, and I'm really blown away. It definitely feels really lightweight. I don't feel like I have anything on, and that is a big plus. To be really honest, the two lip shades that I fell in love with and I'm really happy that I received is it is Ambition Statement, and the other is, what is it called? Global Citizen. I really, really love these lip shades, but I will say as well, be very, very careful when closing these up because they're really runny, really watery, and they will leak. That actually happened to me. I thought I closed it. I wasn't, and it was leaking all over my desk. So 
you know, especially if it's going to be long wearing, it's going to be harder to remove from your desk, from your clothes. So that's the only thing. But other than that, you guys, I feel like $11.50, I feel like it's totally worth it. It is a nice mood to have. And I really love the colors that I picked, to be really honest. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Everything will be linked down below. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more videos just like this one. And I will see you guys all in my next video. I love you guys so, so much. Bye!